Welcome to the Community Health of Central Washington Residency Program. In our community-based residency program, we train patient-centered, culturally sensitive, compassionate family medicine physicians to provide quality care to the diverse patient population in Central Washington and beyond. We work with a wide variety of situations and populations, including hospitals, clinics, urban areas, and rural areas. You will be working in a broad-based community program, one-on-one -on -one with community physicians and attendings. We have an integrated pharmacy program with on-site pharmacies in both the Yakima and Ellensburg clinics. We also have a complete integrated behavioral health program with over a dozen behavioral health professionals working throughout our system. This program allows residents to learn the latest techniques for interacting with behavioral health professionals in a medical setting. We are proud to be the ultimate patient-centered medical home with community doctors working in a community health center serving a diverse patient population. What attracted me to the residency here in Yakima is that it's an unopposed residency and it's in a small community and I like smaller communities because I feel like I can do um, like learn a little bit more and do more things. Um, what's nice about this residency is that it's very strong in terms of its obstetrics care in terms of also inpatient care. On our inpatient rotations, for the most part, we're the only residents around other than some rotating in. So we really get to be in on procedures and meeting the community docs and being a part of deliveries and surgeries as first assist. And it's, uh, it's a great experience. I was attracted to this program for many reasons, but the reason I came to CWFMR was because I really enjoyed seeing the interactions between the residents and faculty. I wanted to come to a place where I knew that faculty were committed to teaching residents and who went out of their way. When I saw the relationship and the interactions when I came for my interview day, I felt like a home, and so that's why I came to this program. What I enjoy most about um, the residency from a learning standpoint is that everyone is open to feedback and they're always there to help push you and challenge you so that you can grow as not only as a physician but also as a person. So in our clinic we see our share of um, socially disadvantaged patients as well and so there is lots of opportunities um, in the community to to um, to serve in terms of like volunteering opportunities. I think it's really important to work with an underserved population. Um, at least for me personally, it's just it's just so it's such a rewarding and humbling experience because people are always so thankful and there's a lot of needs that they have that you're you're able to offer, especially in such a small community. The Ellensburg Rural Site is located in a smaller, more rural community about 30 miles west of Yakima. It is a freestanding 10,500 square foot facility located three blocks from the Rural Critical Access Hospital. The facility houses residency and student education space and faculty offices, as well as clinical space. The clinical area includes 18 exam rooms and one procedure room, as well as on-site pharmacy services. Residents training at this site learn about interaction with patients and medical colleagues in a small town, rural environment. One of the most unique things about training in Allensburg uh, as a rural training site is the fact that it's all three years of your residency uh, rather than just the latter two years. So you have that greater linear education experience and greater continuity with your patients and with the community that you serve there. We are proud to have state-of-the-art integrated behavioral health as part of our program. Having access to behavioral health consultants is a tremendous benefit to residents. Learning about interacting with behavioral health consultants regarding patient care is a unique skill to master. So I've never worked at a clinic that has been as integrated or has as much access for behavioral health consultants as our clinic, and I've never actually heard of one that has. Uh, being able to step out in the middle of a visit, find somebody who has time to actually come in and discuss lifestyle choices with a patient for 20 minutes, instead of just throwing a medication at them for hypertension or diabetes, I think allows me to make much better changes to their overall health and helps them to understand their disease process better. I think the thing that BHC has really helped with uh, improving patient outcomes is it changes the conversation on what we're actually trying to work with. 
Um, you know, instead of focusing solely on symptoms, diagnosis, um, the uh, specific problems that are coming up, we switch the conversation to uh, what's going on in the person's context, what's going on in their life. So it changes it from symptom reduction focus to improving quality of life and then also improving overall function, which is ultimately the goal of primary care, is to uh, give intervention to help people get back to the lives that they want to live and to do the things that they want to do. What I love about the Yakima Valley is it has 300 days of sunshine. It's beautiful, especially in the summer. There's a lot to do, whether it's hiking, going berry picking, making your own apple cider. We have the beautiful Yakima River that you can float down. We have the mountains nearby where you can go skiing. Something I often talk with applicants about is I remind them that they're not just here being interviewed, but they're also interviewing us. They've worked really hard at this point to seek the training that's going to make them the kind of position that they want to be. And it's really important that they make sure that they can find that in whatever program they choose. And for me, that was this program. They had everything that I was looking for. And one of those intangible things they had here was the sense of family, uh, just encouraging and supportive learning environment that, that doesn't exist everywhere else and it really helped me blossom. I know that I will get a, a great training from the attendings here and learn from my fellow residents and I really hope to to be able to learn from all avenues of medicine that are provided here.